So is there an agreement between the Portugal, between Portugal and the U.S. with regards to social security for self-employed people? So this person is saying, I stopped paying self-employment tax when I began working here in Portugal. I'm paying social security only in Portugal, not in the U.S. So uh, again, we, this, we, yeah, this, this is a relatively straightforward one. But there's a totalization agreement between the United States and Portugal. In fact, there's a totalization agreement between the U.S. and most Western European nations, which means that you're not, and you're not required to pay social security contributions twice. And if it is that you are residents in Portugal, which I assume that you are, you should be paying into Portugal. Whoever is doing your U.S. return will make a note on the return, especially if you have like Schedule C income or you have K-1s that may trigger self-employment tax. They should make a note on the return uh, invoking the totalization agreement and letting the IRS know that social charges are being paid in Portugal. So they're not required to be paid into the United States. So for once, we have a straightforward question. All right. <laughs> Please subscribe, like, share, and comment below. Our books and upcoming events are available at htj.txt. Email us at help at htj.txt to engage us to advise on international tax or business matters.